Hello Scorpio, thanks for visiting. This is your reading for October the 28th through to November the 3rd. And if you like this reading, please like, subscribe and comment if that's what you'd like to do. You know I love and appreciate you all for all of your support on my channel. And for private readings specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So Scorpio, let's take a look at the week ahead. Let's see what spirit your angels and guides would like to bring through for you. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Scorpio. And it is a general reading, so please take what resonates for you personally and just leave what doesn't. This is where you're at currently, Scorpio. What's below you, what's behind you, what's above you, and what is coming in towards you. So let's take a look at your first message. And it's the Five of Raphael. And it says, everything happens for a reason. Release regret and embrace the opportunities for happiness. Search for the silver lining. I feel that is very important at the moment in your life, Scorpio. I feel like there may have been some kind of disappointment or loss grief even there is an energy here of having to let go and release and a lot of healing healing energy around you as well so search for the silver lining in a situation because there is one and i am seeing that you are going to be working on your physical health or your um or your mental health maybe it may be emotional as well. There's a lot of different energies around you this week, Scorpio, that I'm picking up. I'm getting a sense that no matter what it is, what it, whatever the energy is, Scorpio, I feel you're going to be on point as in you're going to be looking ahead. You're going to be turning the tables around and being very positive about things and looking ahead rather than looking back, looking back to the past and saying things to yourself like, what if, you know, what if you did this or what if they did this or did that? You can't change that. It's in the past. So I'm seeing a transformation happening here for you, Scorpio. Everything does happen for a reason. And I feel this is a big growth opportunity for you. So no matter what area of life it is or how it's affecting you, know that things are going to improve and that this week there is an energetic opening for you to for you to walk through and for you to see things from a different perspective. So I feel that that's a very positive message from spirit coming through for you. Let's take a look at your second card. And it's the High Lady of Love and Compassion. It's a beautiful energy. The first thing that I'm picking up for you, Scorpio, is that you have a lot of love from spirit around you. There's a wonderful energy surrounding your life, surrounding your being, and a lot of love and compassion coming from the spiritual realms. The keywords here are reverence, kindness, and consideration. So I'm getting a sense that your reinterpretation of what's happened is going to touch on the themes of kindness and consideration, cooperation even, um, and these types of things, and looking at things in a different way to perhaps how you have previously and this may be vice versa someone else in this situation um, you're going to see these qualities in them because um, i feel like it may be a dynamic between you and another person that has caused this uh, feeling or this scenario in your life and even though i feel some for some of you it's outside of your control in a lot of ways i am also feeling that there is an energy here of um, of connectedness between you and another and it's influencing you as much as another person so that's very interesting let's take a look at this card here words of abundance and it says you have the ability to instantly manifest abundance by choosing powerfully positive words always describe your own and the world's economic situation in loving and optimistic terms and that is what you attract for yourself and others. So yes, I do see this as very important this week, Scorpio. I do see abundance coming in for you, whether it is healing related or whether it's um, work related or relationships. There's an energy here of abundance and of healing as well. So I'm getting a sense that if you're able to lift your vibration this week and use positive words and affirmations even and stay on this high vibration wavelength, then that's how you're going to see the different perspective or that's how the 
that's how the situation's going to shift. And so that's your action and, and your um, energy put into the situation in a positive way. So that's what I'm seeing here. It's very positive. So anything that you put out in terms of what you speak, this can be through prayer. It can be through affirmations, like I said. But no matter what it is for you personally, there's going to be abundance. You're going to start to see this wonderful increase, a wonderful settled feeling as well. Calmness and peace and balance come into your life. So very powerful energy there for you, Scorpio. Shanti. And it says, I am the angel of peace. I bring you new tranquility and a smoother road ahead. And that's exactly what I was picking up with here with this words of abundance card. There's a peace and a balance that's going to come into your life this week. And if you don't feel it this week, there's an opportunity for that energy very soon in your life. It may take a perception shift or it may take a certain conversation. Um, I do feel another person is involved very highly in this situation with you. So even though it's personal to you, there's another person here with you along the way that may be involved intimately. There's a sense here of you having spirit around you knowing exactly what you're going through, Scorpio. And I'm getting a sense that you may not even believe that things are going to change, going to change for the better or that peace and harmony is going to come in. Or there's something that's going to kind of catch you off guard a little bit and something they're showing me that you might not even believe that this is going to happen in a positive way a positive shift is going to happen here but it is spirits bring it through very very clearly here Scorpio things are going to shift for the positive so this may be larger in scale for some of you okay so my major life events or more significant life events for some of you and for others it's going to be smaller and more mundane every day-to-day -day things that happen this week where these energies come in and display themselves but no matter what it is there's still a wonderful energy here larger or smaller for you coming in and affecting you in a positive way so believe things are going to improve or that harmony and balance can come in and that a smoother road ahead is there for you very powerful message from spirit this week scorpio and we have the seven of swords so this indicates that there perhaps has been some deceit or some some something hasn't been very clear either another person has been deceitful or you, you may be aware of this you may not be aware of it but there's a sense here of i am getting um, an energy of someone walking away as well walking away from a situation not wanting to communicate with you um, and this type of thing or you may have been secretive about something and not wanting to communicate because it may not have been effective or for whatever personal reason so there's an energy here of kind of going under the radar, not letting things known, whether it's from you or another person. So this is contributing to the situation at hand. And what's below you here is the eight of wands. This is a lot of movement. There's a lot of um, communication, a lot of, um, a lot of passion and vibrant energy, a lot of moving. This can mean actually relocating, traveling and, um, and moving around in a physical way. There's an energy here of communication as well and of getting to the right place with a person in terms of communication and being on the same page as a person and understanding each other in a very, very unique way. So this is all coming into play here. This is in your deep past and around some of you currently affecting the situation around you this week. So there has been a lot of movement with this person or a lot of passion with this person and or with this situation. It doesn't have to be a person, of course. It can be a situation that you're that you're involved with. And there seems to be something going on underneath the surface as well. So let's take a look at what is behind you here in your immediate past. It's the Ace of Wands. So this is an initial burst of energy or it's kind of like a, um, taking the reins and going out and doing something for yourself. So I feel that there's been an empowered energy here coming through from you, Scorpio. So I feel you've kind of actually had a breakthrough here, which is wonderful. You've had a breakthrough um, recently or something has started and it was just the very initial stages and then you found out something along the way. So let's take a look at what is above you here. We have the Knight of Wands. So this is um, a very fiery energy again. So Scorpio, there may be a fire sign around you or significant in some way in your life this week. 
The Knight of Wands is about action and, and taking action on something and having a lot of fiery passion behind you while you do this. This is a knight or this could be a person who comes into your life and then goes again, comes in and then leaves again. And that would fit very much with this energy of the Seven of Swords. So this person may be coming in to your life and then leaving or there's some undercurrent here which you're not you don't know about or you may know about it but it's not out in the open so there's this energy going on here as well I feel for some of you the ace of cups this is wonderful because this indicates that there is healing available to you this week Scorpio you just need to tap into it in a spiritual way pray meditate do whatever it is that you connect into spirit however you do that is perfect for you peace and harmony is coming in here and there's an overflowing of emotion so there's a positive potential for you to move forward in a new partnership or in a new way in this partnership okay whether it's romantic or whether it's platonic in the workplace or a friendship it doesn't matter there's a potential here for you to be able to move forward there's an offer here for you as well an offering and I'm getting a sense that you may not I'm also getting a sense here that you may not um, you may not expect this offer to come in. This could be a spiritual enlightenment. This can be lifting your vibration up higher. This may be an actual physical offer of love or um, a new job or something very physical coming in like this. I feel that you, you're really not expecting this. You possibly won't even believe that it's going to happen. But I am sensing that it will. So remain positive this week, Scorpio. I hope you all have a wonderful week ahead and I'll talk to you all again soon.